Hi, this is Mark from PondalgiSolutions.com and in this video I want to share with you how to repair a rocking piston aeration compressor. Um, what this involves is replacing the rubber seals and gaskets uh, on the piston itself and in the piston chamber. This is basically, other than main, maybe cleaning the air filter, is the only maintenance that you'll really have to do on this type of compressor over a period of several years. Um, there are cases where we'll see a, uh, a rubber seal leak a little bit or through time and through operation and these these compressors are meant to be run continuously they work best that way but over a period of years eventually the rubber seals will wear down once this seal is degraded then the air compression will drop in other words you won't see as much air output out of the diffusers or as much bubbling and when you see this you know that it's time to change uh, change the seals out you may also hear the sound of the compressor change a little bit if you see this it's important to turn off the compressor and not run it um, if this occurs uh, if it goes long enough internal damage could occur to the piston and the piston chambers so uh, turn it off once you see the air drop and then we have a replacement kit available uh, that can be done by most people right at home a few simple tools and a few minutes of your time and you can replace these seals and be up and running again very easily in the segment that follows you're going to see this repair process from start to finish and it will cover some of the tools that are used and and basically everything involved what you have to do it will also show uh, these repair kits and the components in those and we hope you find that useful and after that segment is over I'll be back uh, to close this video out.
easy it is to repair one of these rocking piston aeration compressors. It's a pretty simple straightforward process and it just takes a few simple tools. Normally when we when we see this uh, repair done you can expect another two, three, four years uh, out of the uh, the seals that are put in there. In some exceptional cases we've seen several rocking piston compressors go up to 10 years before they needed the seals replaced but um, at any rate we wanted to let you know that if you do see a compression loss if you do see the air output drop it is most likely going to be related to uh, the rubber seals and gaskets in the piston chamber and on the piston itself and uh, with a simple repair kit it's easy to get up and running once again if you have any additional questions about aerating your pond or aeration equipment or have any questions about your pond in general, be sure to contact us at pondalgesolutions.com and we'll try to help. Take care.